Hey, what's up DIYers, Mike Boards, with the Mike Boards channel. Thank you for watching. Today's video, we are going to do a full makeover of our kids' toy room. We're gonna show you before and after. Let's take a look. To the toy room we go, here it is. And believe it or not, YouTubers, this is clean and organized. However, we got some ideas. So what we'll do is head to the store, buy a couple things and set them up and show you the end result. Coming into the toy room now, and as you can see, a significant difference in layout and design as previously showed. And the whole thought behind this was to basically create a condo or apartment type atmosphere for the kids. They've got a kitchen, they've got a dining room, they've got a living room, and this little nugget couch can fold out and they can create two to three beds with it, which is pretty neat. And by creating it this way, they basically have their own home or condo slash apartment inside our home. So they really love spending a lot of time in this room. We just went to Ikea and purchased a bunch of stuff and a lot of storage, a bunch of storage. These are little cushion blocks. They have a lot of fun with those. And again, this is the nugget couch and you can do a whole bunch of different things with that. And their favorite thing to do with that is to make tunnels and forts. In addition, they've got these little cushion mats where they can jump on all the different colors. These are stepping stones and they love these. And these actually help with balance. So those are productive and beneficial to the kids. In addition, we've got just a rocker strider bike for a little one and more cushion blocks and storage here. Their little dining room table. Pretty neat inside here. They've got a bunch of food. And on this side, they got puzzles. And these actual bins, they can come out. And they don't go pretty deep. As you can see, maybe three to four inches. However, the cool design of this table, you can actually grab one of those larger or deeper bins and insert them in here, but you won't have much clearance for the chairs to be shifted underneath the table. Moving to their kitchen. We've had this for quite a while, and yes, that is a toy or toddler version of the Dyson vacuum cleaner. They absolutely love this. And they've got coffee maker, they've got the chocolate, the hazelnut, and I believe the caramel or vice versa. And check that out. They got the little DIY Raptor mugs. That's just taped on there. And in one of them, one of the kids put an egg inside there, a wooden egg. And it's been in there for months. In addition, we've got bookshelves, a couple on the floor, one up top. And it's a good way to organize the books. The kids do really well with it. Harry the Dirty Dog. My mother-in-law brought this over, and if I remember correctly, this used to be my wife's book when she was a little girl, so that's kind of cool. And my kids love that. They laugh out loud when it is read to them. Pretty funny. Got an abacus and more storage over here. And as far as the decorations on the walls, we've got a United States of America map and a world map on the opposite side. And this is pretty neat because they get to work on geography and learn the countries. And over here, the states have all the capitals. Well, I thought that was pretty cool. I've learned quite a lot since we put this on the wall. Very educational for both the kids and mommy and daddy, which is kind of cool. So I just wanted to show you that. Oh, one more thing. The wife hung really cool light bulbs. And we've got a switch over here. All right, DIYers, it is late at night. The kids are sleeping. I just wanted to show you what the lights look like. Check that out. It definitely lights up the entire room. We love it. Hey, hopefully the video helped. Do us a favor below the video. You'll see that thumbs up icon. Click on that, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Definitely ring your YouTube bell. That would be very helpful to us. We would really appreciate it. Thanks again for watching.